G'day guys, how's it going? The Bont 4 here, and um, yeah, sorry for the horrible lighting, and sorry for just the not great quality. I'll try and get like a better camera or phone or some shit, because um, yeah, I don't have the best quality with my videos, but I like putting them out, so I may as well just keep doing them while I can. So, um, I'll be talking about um, the Western Bulldogs vs. Frio game tomorrow, I think it's at 6.10, I'm just doing a bit of a preview before the game. Um... And yeah, it's going to be um, a pretty close one, I reckon, because Dockers are in excellent form. They've been playing some really good footy, and I'm a bit nervous because um, we're a team who can either be, when on the day, absolutely elite and just blow teams out of the water, or just be very poor and get blown out of the water. So, um, yeah, very nervous because, depending on today's um, outcome between Melbourne and Essendon, if we don't win this game, we might not make the eight. We could be kicked out of the eight and Melbourne could take us, but it's just between us and Melbourne now, I think, because St. Kilda have definitely made it now. Great win from the Saints last night. They were um, outstanding. They just bullied GWS, GWS um, pretenders. They um, had, had a very disappointing year. Now, I reckon, other than North Melbourne, GWS have been one of the most disappointing sides of the year. Um, and it's good as a Dogs fan because I don't really like the Giants, so it's good seeing them lose. But, um, yeah, Saints absolutely outclassed them last night. And they're definitely not making finals. So it's just between us and Melbourne. The D's play today. I'm praying. I am praying that Essendon get the job done. If they do, um, we will definitely make finals. Because they're behind us in points. And we are making finals. We're a game ahead of Melbourne. So I'm praying Essendon win. If they don't, we're just going to have to be good enough to beat the Dockers. If we don't beat Dockers, we're not good enough to be in finals. So yeah, simple as that. Um, I'd just like to say congratulations to Mitch Wallace, 150 games, he's been a very good um, contributor for our team, love the way he goes about his stuff, he has just improved so much this last couple of years, especially this year, he's been absolutely amazing for the Dogs, I think he's our leading goal kicker and he's a small guy, so um, yeah, I've loved the way he has gone about it this year, um, very good stuff because he a couple of years ago, 2016, he got injured and really, really hurt himself, broke his leg, that was a horrible incident. And he's just come back even stronger and as a better player. Missed out on the 2016 Grand Final. Hopefully he gets to play in a Grand Final for us one day, though. That'd be amazing. Because um, he's a very great bloke as well. But, um, yeah, Dockers coming in the game with really good form. We're coming in the game in pretty good form, too, to be honest. Because we, um, we blew the game against the Cats. The two games before that, we beat Adelaide and Melbourne pretty convincingly. We blew Cats. Um, we beat the Eagles. And then we beat the Hawks. So we last four out of five games we won. And we should have beaten Geelong. So we are in great form coming up to this game. So all we need to do is just win this game. Even if Melbourne win today, we're making finals. Um, like I said, hopefully the Bombers get the job done today. Even though I love the Ds, I'm sorry. If I'd rather the Dogs make it over the Ds. But um, yeah, I'm looking forward to tomorrow's game. Very nervous, like I said. But um, it'll be a good one because the Dockers will give us a bit of a um, go. Because, yeah, that that is a... Um, young, improving side. L lots of good players. Fife, um, Sarah, Kara, how do you want to say his name? Um, Sarong, Brayshaw, um, Tabner in the forward line. So they've just got a great team, and they're going to be probably featuring in finals in the next couple of years. I'm not sure about um, grand final yet, but I reckon next year they'll be up there in the finals. They'll be just as good as the Eagles are. Eagles are struggling, actually, in form of the guys. I think they lost to North Melbourne. But, um, yeah, it's going to be a great game. Good luck to the Frio. Dockers, um, but yeah, and good luck to Melbourne. If you win and we don't win, we're not good enough. Good on you guys. I really like the D's, so I won't be too um hard, bad. What do you call it? I won't be too mad if we... Oh, I'll be very, very, very frustrated. But if I had to give any spot up for the eight, I'd give it up to Melbourne because they're just a genuine team. I love them, and other than the dogs. But yeah, and also I might have to buy a GWS Guernsey if we don't make the eight, and I don't want to do that, so just please win. But yeah, if I have to give this eight up to anybody to beat in Melbourne. So um, yeah, good luck to both sides. But um, yeah, it should be a winning game for us because we are the better side on paper, and we are probably favourites, and it's not in Perth. So up the dogs, let's get into the eight.